Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to Quick Tech Tips and Reviews. My name is Tony, and in this channel we bring you a variety of tech-related content. If this is your first time here, please be sure to subscribe and hit that little bell so that you're alerted to when new content is being released. In today's video, I thought I'd do something a little fun and compare the speeds of an Edge Router X to that of a USG. All right, guys, so I happen to have an Edge Router X and a USG in my lab, so I thought for fun we'd just do some basic speed tests and a comparison between the two. Just so you know, both have been set up pretty much standard out of the box, no special configurations or QoS settings or anything like that. So to get started, I thought we would take a look at the data sheet for each, just do a quick comparison of the processor power and the system memory. So on the Edge Router X, you can see the processor is a dual core 880 megahertz and the system memory is 256 mem DDR3. If we look at the specs for the USG, the same specs, the processor is a dual core 500 megahertz, so slightly slower processor, and the system memory is 512, which is double that of the Edge Router X, but it's DDR2, not DDR3. So let's get on to the test now and see how each of these perform. What I'm going to do is run three tests at speedtest.net, and we're going to take the average of all three tests, seeing as there could be some fluctuation um, in measuring bandwidth. So we'll do it three times, we'll take the average, and we'll see who wins. All right, guys, so you saw the side-by-side -side results from each individual test. I've taken all that information and compiled it on a quick spreadsheet for us to take a look at. That being said, I just want to point out, I conducted the test by plugging in my computer directly into each router's LAN port. I recorded the speed test with my cell phone and imported that footage so that this way I didn't put any additional demand on my computer's processing power and we got as true results as possible. So taking a look at the results, you can see the edge router's up on top, the USG's down below, there's test one, two, and three. And if you look at the final average column on the right, you can see that both uh, devices perform fairly equal with the USG um, slightly up on the download speed, 163 to 160 to that of the edge router. It had a slightly higher ping average and a slower, slightly slower upload speed, but overall they both perform pretty much the same. Again, um, I did this for fun and for informational purposes only, so I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to check out some of my other videos. Please remember to subscribe, like, and share, and use those Amazon affiliate links if you want to buy any of the equipment. It doesn't change your price, but it does help out the channel a little, keeps the content coming. Again, my name is Tony with Quick Tech Solutions. Thank you for watching. See you next time.